Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to get on here today because I've had several requests to do a tutorial on how I do my high ponytail. This is going to be real fast, I think, because I don't really do much. I have um, two ponytail holders and I usually do it from, you know, pretty styled in full so I can have a, you know, pretty full ponytail. Then I don't really use a brush. I guess if it was too tangled, I would, but um, I just kind of work it up with my, you know, kind of work it up, kind of smoothing, and I'm leaving kind of a little bump right here. You know, I kind of leave that a little bit loose because I'm going to want a good, some good height right there. Okay, and then when I get it up, I just make sure that I don't have any major bumps. It's, it doesn't need to look perfect, but you know, just most of it, you know, pretty smooth. And then after I kind of pull it up, I kind of let it relax before I put my ponytail holder in. Then while I'm still holding it, I'm going to pull hair, hold it kind of loose. I'm going to pull hair from right there, from both sides, kind of up here. So that if I pull any down, any hair I don't want down, I can recollect it before I put it in a ponytail. Okay, then I'm going to re-smooth it. Okay. When you have the hairs down, yeah, those are those are good hairs. So I've got my hairs down that I want down. And then I'm just going to pull it tight kind of on the sides, but leave it kind of, you know, relaxed up here. I'm pulling my, and pulling from the, you know, pulling it tight in the back. Okay, then when I pull this tight, I'm going to pull from the sides and pull up. I don't want to pull that bump out. Okay, then you can kind of mess with your bump, kind of get it where you want it. If you pull too much, you know, make it too high, you can always kind of fix it with one of these or bobby pins. You know, and then kind of distribute your hair evenly so it's fallen on both sides. And I'll tell you, some of this depends on the cut. Sometimes my cut makes a better ponytail than others. Okay, then I've got my hairs down, my hair on both sides, my tendrils, and um, if I need to shape those, I'll pull the flat iron down and kind of bump it out on the ends, bump it out instead of in. I mean, you know, it's personal preference. I usually just kind of have mine kind of out. And then I, over here, have these real unhealthy hairs right here. And I pull those down. But um, I'll flat iron those if they need it, which they kind of don't today. I've already had my hair up in a ponytail once to get down for this tutorial. Okay, then when I get all the hair, you know, pretty much like I want it, I've got my other ponytail, and I'm just going to slide that over the top of this one. Again, not disturbing this bump. Got to have that hop, and then pulling from the sides and, you know, underneath, never pulling really on that bump. And then, you know, you just... Um, redistribute your hair like you like it. Sometimes, um, you know, if I get it real good and I want it to stay, I'll spray my ponytail. Fix my bangs. Yeah, and that is pretty much, you know, I kind of mess with it through the day, but that is pretty much my high ponytail. Super easy. Super fast, super comfy. So anyway, and yeah, if you have any questions or comments, I'd be happy to answer those. Just put those down below. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe. And I will talk to y'all soon. Y'all have a good day. Bye.